two top self-hosted deployment platforms battle it out. Coolify versus Dockploy. Which one really delivers? On the left, Coolify, the feature-rich self-hosted deployment platform. And on the right, Dockploy, the lightweight and streamlined solution built for speed. Let's skip the buzzwords and dig into what actually matters. Each key category scores points, and by the end, you'll see exactly who comes out on top. The result could surprise you. All right, so here's how we're going to break it down. We're going to look at ease of use, features and compatibility, performance and scalability, security, pricing, application deployment, and finally, community and adoption. This way, you'll get a 360-degree view, and honestly, you'll know what to expect from both platforms. So, first up, ease of use. Coolify's dashboard is more organized. And oh, there's even a built-in onboarding guide, which is perfect if you're new and kind of want your hand held through those first steps. The menus? Super detailed. Plus, you get SSL pre-configured, so no fiddling around. But it's got a slightly more complex initial setup. So if you're impatient, you might feel that learning curve. Dockploy, on the other hand, nails simplicity. It's lightweight, the interface is cleaner, and honestly, deployments just feel snappier. But if you're a total beginner, you'll notice less step-by-step -step guidance, and setting up SSL isn't as automatic. So if you just want to get going without much hassle, Dockploy is nice, but Coolify still feels like the friendlier guide here. Next, let's talk features and compatibility. Coolify packs in more database support, Dragonfly, Clickfly, you name it. There's real-time monitoring, comprehensive logging, plus automatic SSL. It's a lot, right? The downside? Not as many integrations with outside platforms. Dockploy's more streamlined. It's got killer compatibility with build packs, really tight CI-CD pipelines. So if you love integrating build tools, this is nice. Fewer built-in databases and monitoring options, though. Still, Coolify's arsenal is hard to ignore if you want everything in one spot. Now, performance and scalability. So, here's where things get spicy. Coolify is great if you're on a single server. Pretty modest on CPU and RAM. But when it comes to spreading out across multiple servers, it's less mature, and you might feel that pinch. Dockploy, though? Oh, man. It shines in multi-server deployments. It has a native load balancer. Traffic does microservices like a champ, and horizontal scaling is just easier. Uses a bit more RAM, but honestly, if you plan to grow, that trade-off is worth it. Dockploy takes this one. Oh, and here's something cool. Did you know both Coolify and Dockploy, even though they feel lightweight, need at least two CPU cores, two gigs of RAM, and 30 gigs of storage just to run smoothly? So don't skimp on your server setup. Security! Now Coolify really flexes here. SSL, out of the box, strong privacy, and regular updates. There's no vendor lock-in too, which is actually rare and super nice. Dockploy does support SSL, container isolation, and flexible security configs, but it's a bit more do-it-yourself, like manual setup, and you've got to follow best practices. SSL isn't on by default, which is kind of a pain, not gonna lie. Coolify is definitely more reassuring here. Let's get into pricing. Both Coolify and Dockploy are totally free and open source, so yeah, that's awesome. Coolify actually offers a managed plan for 4 bucks a month if you want more hand-holding. But otherwise, you're only paying for infrastructure. Dockploy keeps it self-hosted and free. So, it's basically a tie here. You just have to manage your own server costs either way. On to application deployment. With Coolify, you deploy straight from Git, auto-build with Docker, and even grab deployment templates. Super versatile, but the process is a tiny bit slower. Dockploy is all about speed. One-click deployments, Way better with multi-container Docker apps, and it's honestly seamless if you need integration with external clouds. Plus, you get a centralized dashboard. The only trade-off? Less in the way of templates. Still, for quick modern deployments, Dockploy wins out. Finally, let's chat about community and adoption. Coolify's got, what, over 46,000 GitHub stars? The community is bigger, it's more mature, and their documentation actually answers your questions. Dockploy is growing with 25,000 stars. Not too shabby. The platform's newer, but it's catching up. But if you want support right now and less guesswork, Coolify definitely has the upper hand. Let's zoom out and look at the big picture. A radar chart to see where each platform really shines. You'll notice Coolify scores high on security, features, and community support, while Dockploy dominates in scalability and deployment speed. All right, so here's my honest opinion. If you're building with a team, want every feature under the sun, and value security and community. Coolify is just hard to beat. Now, if you crave quicker, more scalable deployments, love working with microservices, and want everything to feel snappy and modern, then Dockploy is pretty awesome for developers or small projects. So 
pick what matches your workflow. If you want to support our channel, feel free to use our affiliate link given in video description. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next video.